but of jokes. Prince Harry brutally mocked on interview with the vampire, the prisoner of SB. The usually unflappable Prince Harry found himself the butt of merciless jokes and ridicule during a recent appearance on the hit show interview with the vampire, the prisoner of SB. The Duke of Sussex, who has been making headlines lately for his tell-all memoir and various public statements, was completely unprepared for the savage onslaught he faced from the show's hosts and fellow guests. It all started when Prince Harry was invited onto the show to promote his new book Spare. The prince, likely hoping for a friendly, soft-hitting interview, was instead ambushed by the show's hosts, acclaimed actors Tom Hiddleston and Tilda Swinton, as well as special guest Kristen Stewart. From the moment Harry stepped onto the set, it was clear the gloves were off. So, Prince Harry, tell us, how does it feel to be the most ridiculed member of the royal family? Hiddleston asked with a wry smile, eliciting laughter from the audience. I mean, at least your brother William has the good looks and charm to fall back on. You on the other hand, well? Harry attempted to brush off the jab with a nervous chuckle, but Swinton quickly piled on. Yes, and let's not forget your famous Nazi costume incident. Really, Harry, were you going for unhinged royal or just total embarrassment with that one? The stinging comments seemed to catch the prince off guard, and he struggled to regain his composure as the merciless mocking continued. And of course, who could forget your little Megxit saga, Hiddleston added, making exaggerated air quotes. Abandoning the royal family to go live in California. Very noble of you, your highness. By this point, Harry was visibly squirming in his seat, his face flushed with embarrassment. But the verbal assault was far from over. Enter Kristen Stewart, who had been quietly observing the exchange with a mischievous grin. You know, I have to say, I'm really impressed by your ability to stay relevant, Harry, she chimed in, her voice dripping with sarcasm. I mean, most people would have faded into obscurity after that whole nude photos in Las Vegas debacle. But not you. You just keep finding new and creative ways to embarrass yourself. The audience erupted in laughter as Harry buried his face in his hands, clearly wishing he could disappear. But the hosts and Stuart were relentless, firing off jab after jab at the hapless prince. And let's not forget your little Invictus game stunt, Hiddleston said, shaking his head in mock disappointment, trying to ride on the coattails of wounded veterans to make yourself look good. Truly noble of you, your highness. Swinton leaned in, her eyes narrowed. You know, Harry, I have to ask, does Megan ever get tired of having to constantly clean up after your messes? I imagine it must be exhausting. At this point, Harry was visibly wilting under the onslaught, his usual confident demeanor shattered. But the hosts and Stuart showed no mercy, continuing to heap ridicule and humiliation upon the hapless prince. And let's not forget your infamous Oprah interview, Hiddleston chimed in, his voice dripping with sarcasm airing all your dirty laundry for the whole world to see. Very classy, your highness. Swinton nodded in agreement. Yes, and let's not forget your Netflix documentary, what was it called again? Harry and Meghan. The delusional duo? By this point, Harry was visibly trembling, his face a mask of humiliation and defeat. The audience, sensing his discomfort, erupted in raucous laughter and applause, egging on the hosts and Stuart. Finally, after what felt like an eternity of relentless mockery, the segment came to an end. Harry, his once proud bearing utterly shattered, slumped off the set, leaving the hosts and Stuart to bask in the adulation of the audience. As the cameras stopped rolling, the true extent of the prince's humiliation became clear. Harry, once the darling of the royal family, had been reduced to a laughingstock, the butt of countless jokes and barbs. And judging by the reaction of the audience, it seems the public has little sympathy for the embattled royal. Only time will tell if Harry can recover from this latest PR disaster. But one thing is certain, the prince's appearance on Interview with the Vampire, the prisoner of SB will go down as one of the most savage and merciless celebrity roastings in recent memory.